My Analog Project 2011 continues in the month of November with the Olympus Trip 35. This camera was manufactured by Olympus in 1967. It's a 35mm point and shoot camera that features a 40mm lens that shoots from f2.8 to f22. It has a zone focusing system here so you have your icons on the lens barrel to help you gauge the distance from your subject to the camera. The camera has an ISO range from 25 to 400. Uh, this camera also features two shooting modes. You have a full automatic mode selectable here on the lens barrel by rotating the, uh, the aperture dial to the letter A. And when it's in the, uh, full, uh, app, the full automatic mode, you have a default shutter speed of 1 200th of a second for all of your shots. The uh, second mode is the aperture priority mode, or Olympus likes to refer to it as the flash mode, to uh, be used mainly indoors with really dark uh, lighting situations. You rotate the aperture dial to a preferred uh, aperture setting or f-stop setting. The camera will default to a shutter speed of 1 40th of a second for every shot. Uh, they say that the both modes work great. Um, Olympus intended for the uh, the flash mode or the aperture priority mode to be used with a flash, uh, but I've used this outdoors in really shady situations without a flash, and I've had no issues with it uh, whatsoever. Outside of that, the camera has basic features. You have a rewind crank, you have a flash hot shoe, shutter release button, a film counter. Uh, the camera also features a PC sync port on the front. On the bottom, your typical uh, rewind uh, button and a tripod socket. And here's your film advance wheel right here in your, uh, your uh, viewfinder here. This camera uh, functions very similar to my other camera, the Olympus uh, Pen EE2. Uh, this also is a point and shoot camera. This one is a half frame, gives you those half frame images versus the uh, wider uh, 35 millimeter. This one's 35 millimeters, so half frame, and I, and I love this camera, and I used this one uh, recently in the Analog Project uh, 2011. Uh, but both cameras function virtually uh, identical, almost the same features. And this one as well has that little block that I hate when you don't have enough light coming into the camera uh, the camera will shut you down and, and prevent you from uh, taking a photograph. It puts up a little red tongue. Let's see if you can see that little red tongue in the window telling you you don't have enough light. It prevents you from taking a picture. From there, you're prompted to rotate the dial into an f-stop and continue on from there. But, you know, I get around that with no issues. Uh, so there it is, the Olympus uh, Trip 35. Be shooting with this for the entire month of November on my Analog Project 2011. You can find the photographs from this, fo uh, from this camera on Flickr.com and Dread242.com. So tune in next month when I'll feature another one of my vintage cameras. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next month.